Good afternoon and welcome to today's ceremony honoring our newest Batten scholars. During our matriculation ceremony in August, I commented on the generosity and vision of those who made this incredible program possible. Once again, I thank the Batten family for their belief in Virginia Wesleyan and the three pillars of the Batten Honors College, environmental stewardship, global engagement, and leadership. We host this traditional ceremony in recognition of the mission for all Batten Honors College scholars to be more impactful leaders and environmental stewards in the global community. During today's ceremony, our new scholars will be presented with pins which are specially designed for the Batten Honors College. The Batten Honors College is one of just 147 Honors College programs nationally and the only one, we believe, to be environmentally focused. Out of a pool of over 30,000 potential students, you are one of just 40 students chosen to join this highly selective program. You were invited on the basis of academic performance, compelling personal essays, and remarkable service and extracurricular activities. You were chosen because you are truly the best and the brightest. The pins you'll be given today represent the completion of the rigorous selection process, orientation to the mission and ideals of this highly selective program matriculation, and now full integration as members of the university community. I know you'll wear them with pride on campus and off and with the recognition that you richly deserve as the newest scholars to enroll in this prestigious program. Before our students are pinned, I have a special ceremonial presentation of my own. Dr. Travis Malone, Dean of the Baton Honors College, please join me. As these newest scholars are being pinned in recognition of their immersion into the Baton Honors College, let's not forget that you are a new and emerging leader of the program too. Therefore, I present to you the Dean's Medallion for the Baton Honors College. May you wear it with pride during campus regalia events, and may its weight remind you of the hopes and expectations of the Baton scholars here today and all of the Batten scholars who are to come. Thank you. Students, we expect a lot from you too. You represent diversity, intellectual strength, curiosity, imagination, and individual ambition, the best kinds of qualities that have always distinguished American higher education and will continue to do so long after you've completed your years here at the university. Yet I know that you have high expectations for yourselves as well. Having said that, I hope you'll enjoy this unique educational journey and that, like all students, you will find necessary balance between rigorous academic discipline and the rewards of co-curricular and recreational activities that are so much a part of campus life. Again, I congratulate you on your enrollment in the Baton Honors College and wish you tremendous success and enjoyment in the months and years ahead. Dr. Svenicky. Good afternoon, everybody. Should I turn this on? OK. It's on? Can you guys hear me? Good. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Dr. Antje Schwenicke. Um, I am the Assistant Dean of the Batten Honors College and the Batten Associate Professor of Political Science. When I started preparing for the remarks that I was going to give today, um, I went back to some of the essays you guys wrote for the honors competition. These essays were not empty words. They allowed us here at Virginia Wesleyan to understand your goals for your future. And we were able to see if your dreams and intentions support the vision we have for everyone in the Baton Honors College. Now you're here, you made it through the first two weeks of classes, and you're officially joining the community of Baton Honors students. 
I want to remind you of some of the things you wrote in your essays. I'm not going to call names, so don't worry. Um, I strive to be the best leader and decision maker I can be. I too want to gain a different perspective from another culture, a land that has different values, unwritten rules and perspectives. I want to see that perspective and be able to use it. I am confident that the Baton Honors College will help me grow into, into a conscientious global citizen. And this one's my personal favorite. A liberal arts education offers a chance for exploration. It teaches, as the world becomes more diverse, it teaches others how to interact with one another and solve worldly problems. The Honors College offers opportunities academically, socially, and in experience. I want to gain relationships with my teachers, teachers through smaller class sizes and have compelling discussions. I want to be surrounded by classmates who challenge my thinking and ideas. I want to gain experiences abroad, helping others. At the end of the program, I will have a better knowledge of other cultures and ways to help others. After the program, I want to have leadership characteristics that will take the initiative. My interpersonal skills will have significantly improved. Overall, I will be able to say I'm more involved in community service and grew in wisdom. These are your words not mine. So I'm going to hold you to your words. But it's not just I who will expect you to live up to the intentions you wrote about in your essays. You're now part of a community of students in the Baton Honors College who share similar goals. And they're all here, so there you go. Um, all of you are here to hold each other accountable, to remind each other of your responsibility to, put, to be conscientious and active global citizens ones who make a difference in this world. So where do you start and what do you do? Maybe some of you are thinking it was a lot easier to write a fancy essay than to sit in this chair and be confronted with the expectation to actually do what you wrote about. Marcos nodding his head. Um, all those months ago, while well, you will spend the next four years learning about all the ways you can create the change you want to see around you, I will start you off with this. Think about your immediate environment the community you become part of today, and the more encompassing communities you will be part of for the rest of your life. The Baton Honors College, Virginia Wesleyan, Hampton Roads, the United States, and the global community. You can start small and work your way up. Every little step counts on your quest to make the world a better place. And what can you do? You only have to look to the United Nations and its goals for sustainable development to understand that so many challenges we face in this world are interconnected. The protection of the environment, sustainable economic development, and the reduction of poverty, hunger, and inequality cannot be addressed in isolation. Be driven to know more about these issues, to understand the big picture, to break conventions when other people think inside the box. Learn as much as you can from your peers, all of them, your professors, and from your experiences here at Virginia Wesleyan to connect all these different dots. And then you go out and you make a difference at every level you can, all the way up. Start small, think big, and know that you're not doing it alone. You are now part of a community that shares your vision and is here to support you and support each other at every step of the way. We're proud to welcome you to this community of the Baton Honors College and wish you a successful journey to becoming the leaders, stewards of the environment, and impactful global citizens that you told us you want to be. Thank you. At this time, we're going to present you with your pins. I'd first like to call forth the volunteers from our community who have volunteered to be your peer mentors, your guides in this first year. But they don't just extend from these first 12 individuals with whom I'm gonna uh, call up in just a moment. Extend to all of those behind you and all of those who wear and share the pin that you all have had. There, you are the only ones with these pins. Only people who are in the Baton Honors College have that distinction and are responsible to that community. And to much that is given, much is expected. The peer mentors who will be pinning you today, come forward, please. Cassidy Braithwaite, 
Jack Palmer, Kira Doyle, Elaine Robbins, Lauren Faulkner, Jaden Shaw, Henry Handley, Emily Smith, Grant Morgan, Kat Vandenberg, Brooke Morris, Lindsay White, Brianna Wimbush, and Jill Maholland, who stand in today as Connor Merck. So come on up. We'll have all of you stand behind the banner. As we ask, we'll bring you up each individually and alphabetically. And you'll stand right here as your mentor will meet you and present you with your pin. And they'll pin it on your baton collar lapel. Our first student, Aaron Andrews. Katie Baker. Yep. Good. Casey Bennett. Sarah Blackburn. <laughs> Luke Bukowski. Kirkland Butler. <laughs> Sai Shalagungla. Caitlin Deswalt. <laughs> Jenna Elswick. Amalia Hauf. <laughs> 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 
Kim Kosinski. <laughs> Emma Lankford. Christopher Lopez. <laughs> Jalen Major. Hank MacArthur. <laughs> Marco Molino. Emily Moody. <laughs> Josiah Palma. Christian Palmasano. <laughs> Audrey Roberts. Landon Rockwell.
Steven Schneider. Sammy Sylvia. <laughs> Harry Smith. Ellie Snowman. <laughs> Josh Spicer. Stone Sterling. <laughs> Dino Stickley. Owen Stewart. <laughs> Sarah Traver. Evelyn Weaver. <laughs> Emma Weir. Jessica Wilson. Lauren Wynn. <laughs> Mary, 
Madeline Yale. And Kayla Yoakum. Please rise, class of 2021, Baton Honors College. Turn around and welcome your community. Community, welcome our fellow classmates. And now that we're all, now that we're all standing, please join me in the alma mater. I'd like to thank you all for joining us today. I'd like to thank the Baton Honors College upperclassmen for making this milestone of our newest scholars a priority in your own lives. This is the kind of community involvement that makes the Baton Honors College such a special place to study and to grow. Thanks to the families and friends who are watching via our live stream. Your students love you and miss you even if they don't call or text <laughs> as much as you would like. And thank you to our newest class of Batten Scholars. You made a great choice in coming to Virginia Wesleyan, and I hope you're jumping into your courses and co-curricular activities with both feet. As the saying goes, how's the saying go? It's a great day to be a Marlin! Congratulations, everyone. <laughs>